previously old school 80s 90s theme song video reaction <laughs> Like your parents were, you are the secret force of pole position. They're moving really fast, they're the only ones who can get there on time. Okay, sis. And never too far behind, they're always fighting crime. Stop on the cover, ready when you are, Rhodey. In the danger zone. Listen to the lyrics, though. Pretty soon they'll be off on a mission. Mission. High High level 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 Proposition. Proposition. Hold on, their cars can talk back to them like Knight Rider? I think I just realized that, or I did before but buried it in my psyche. Was this before Knight Rider show or after Knight Rider show? What year? I'm about to Google that later. Pole Position. Who wrote these lyrics fam? Who wrote these lyrics dude? These, these are beautiful, beautiful, beautiful theme songs. Pole position. They're really feeling what they're saying. They believe in it. That's, that's the thing that made these theme songs so, so beautiful, so fiery, so timeless. They believe what they're saying. So I guess it makes the viewers, the children, I'm, I'm, and I assume some of the adults who watch this with their children as well, who love cartoons. Like I'm a grown, grown child, now adult, who obviously loves cartoons. Yes, cartoons are made by adults. So I imagine that there must be there must have been some adults out there who enjoyed these cartoon theme songs as well. But my goodness, pole position! Listen to how they're singing it. They're feeling it from their soul. Sit back and rock and roll. Who does that, man? It's a theme song. The passion they put behind these theme songs. I'm always amazed and thankful. I'm very thankful I got to experience these these uh, cartoons. Got to experience this in my childhood. Really thankful because boy. Pole position. What's behind this control? Pole position. Only there are the laws. Pole position. Sit back and watch the laws. This is one of my favorite parts coming. Dude, are you, oh my, you guys don't, oh shit. Come on, son. What mood was that person or who even chose to do that part? Was that like a little show off thing? And at the end, come on, son. Come, I don't, some people don't appreciate the combination of these different in instruments to come together to make this one final thing. Nah, some of y'all don't appreciate it. You don't. Let me just take it back one more time. Do, 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 Dude, dude, somebody was excited. Do 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 dum 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 do do boom. Somebody was excited. They must have been high as fuck, high than a mother, man. Now nah, you guys must have been tripping making these theme songs. Otherwise, nah, it's just wow. Bull position. Let's do a soft cartoon, then we end on a kicker. Yeah. 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 Feel that chair now. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's rock and roll. Soft cartoon and then end on spicy one. This one, you guys, a lot of people will be familiar with this. Like there's, there's some theme songs some people don't even know or some cartoons some people don't even know, let alone theme songs. Like if you play a particular part of a theme song for me, not even the whole thing, I'll be able to figure it out. Bullshit. Roughly, roughly. I don't want someone to put me to the test and then send, send me some stuff in the, in the DM or in the email. Where does this come from? And give me a 30 second or 15 second clip. I think most cartoon theme songs that I'm familiar with, I can I can tell from just yeah any part of the, yeah, I think. Ah. I'm confident enough that I can. All right then. This one everyone knows. One of my favorite too. Oh, my bad. is gonna kick in. One, two, three, go. Ooh, yo, boy, the pre-roll. Come on, take it back, take it back, take it back. Come on, dude, that was awesome. It is things like that that someone says, just add this part here. That's why I love editing my videos with little um, memes and gifs or gifs and sound bites. It's just just something, just something about it. It's almost, I don't know, I don't, I don't know how to explain it. Ah! 
<gasps> I don't know how to describe it. I don't know if the person or persons um, responsible for these theme songs were like, I bet when it comes to this part of the theme song, they're going to lose their shit. I don't know, but I don't even know if there's anyone out there who also reacts to these theme songs the way I'm currently reacting to them as well. I don't know if there's anyone who's vibing to them the way I do. I can play some theme songs on repeat, like the pole position one. Get out of town, man. Even mask. M -m 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 mask. And why? Why that? Why the m -m 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 why not just mask? Do 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 Mask. That's fine. But they had to go m -m -m mask do 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 m -m 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 mask. Why? Why the m -m 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 you didn't have to do that at all, but something spoke to them and said, yo, do the m -m -m mask and it worked. It worked. Dude, there must be an alternate timeline or a parallel earth where the theme songs weren't as, as spicy as this. <laughs> if there's another earth where the theme songs are better than this, take me there. Let's go. Nice. I challenge the multiverse right now <laughs> to drop me into another earth where the theme songs of these exact same cartoons were better than this, this current version of earth. I don't think there are. Come on. I challenge any watcher being, what? any multiverse being, even my future self or my parallel earth self, come get your boy while I'm asleep, while I'm awake. Put me on a parallel earth where these exact same cartoons in your earth, the theme songs are better than this. I'll wait. Until then, let's continue. <laughs> I mean, to you make these things, to make these puppets? And I always wanted those Lego, whatever things they were, they had. They, those things looked, I don't know what, what word to use. Um, not only did it look like they would be fun to play with, but they, they had this serenity feeling to them. Like you would just be at peace building whatever you're building. Th those little minion munching, munch, munchkin things were always building. Damn. This is one of the shows that I watched not knowing what the world is about, not knowing if, if this is like a parallel planet or world where there are no humans. Were there humans in this world? I can't remember. This is another show that, that I just watched as it came and I never followed it episodically following a, a main story. Or I mean, I got the theme where there were these other creatures outside from the Fraggle Rock that they're always running from. And there's this one guy who they always got mail from, from their clan or their uh, species, but they would always have to go through a garden and the garden creatures looked humanoid, but they weren't human. So unless they were like exact, I don't know. I, I, I have no idea what this story is about, but dude, they had me glued to the screen too, man. Didn't mind it. <laughs> yeah, this is the part. Yeah, the garden. I guess. Okay, I say humanoid because of the physique, but no, it's definitely clearly not human. But I mean, maybe they're supposed to be mocking. I don't know. I don't know. I don't want to sound like as if I know what the hell is going on because I don't. What the hell is a fraggle rock? I dislike that this guy was always such a Debbie Downer. Every time he was on scene, I'm like, man, shut your boy up. Always whining about something, man. I mean, I get it. You, you know, I guess it was a, a different archetype for the cartoon. There was the go lucky one, the happy one, the exciting one, the poetry one, the one that writes, the one that likes to read. Everyone had their different um, characteristics and attributes. But him, sometimes they featured him too much in some of the episodes. And he was like, I was like, yo, dude, can you switch up the characters, please? I need to do a Sesame Street one. one. Two, three, four, five, all right then, now let's do the final one. This is exciting. Are you ready, ladies and gentlemen? Are you prepared? Let me set it up. Saber Rider and the Star Sheriff. Saber Rider and the Star Sheriff. Can you feel the thunder inside? <laughs> Imagine saying that to your girl. <laughs> oh, dude, I'm sorry. 
<laughs> Actually, not sorry, dude. That was priceless. Can you feel the thunder inside? <laughs> dude, the intro is sick already, man. And the witch, the whip. Why the whip? Just like the mask. M -m -m mask. Why the whip? God, man. My dear. Rider. The star sheriff, saber rider, and the star sheriff of the sky. Can you feel the thunder inside? <laughs> rider, if you that the attack is you ride, saber rider. That was a whole rift. That was a whole rift. Ah, man. These guys must have come from a different planet just to work on cartoon theme songs. And that was it. That was a whole rift. Damn, son. I'm taking it back. The rider. rider and the star sheriff. Whoops, my bad. Too early. Rider and the star sheriff in the sky. Bing, 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 I'm having so much fun with these. I can't wait to do the next video. I cannot wait to do the next video. Like Give me like three cartoons that I haven't mentioned here. I might mention in my other video or if, if it's on my list. Yeah, don't worry about it. If it's not on my list, let a brother know in the comments. Three cartoon theme songs that you liked. I might, it might be ones I disliked. It might be ones that, that I liked. You never know. Put them in the comments. Let me see if I can do a reaction to them or add them to my list or do a separate video for them. Then when I do the cartoons and theme songs that I did, or cartoons and their theme songs that I didn't like, I'll ask y'all as well so I can just compile a whole uh, section and I won't spend too much time on the theme songs. I might maybe just spend some time and just rip them apart. <laughs> Who knows? Let a brother know in the comments. Which of these cartoons did you guys watch growing up as well? Which, which ones did you like and dislike out of the list I've given? Um, right at the beginning, we started with Defenders of the Earth. We did Mask. We did Muppet Babies. Then we did Pole Position, then we did Fraggle Rock, and ended ended with uh, Saber Rider. Dude, Saber Riders, and the Star Sheriff, <laughs> Sheriff, <laughs> and the Star Sheriff. <laughs> Let a brother know. Put it in the comments. Which one did you like? Which ones didn't you like? Which ones did you watch? Yeah, I guess that's all I can ask. <laughs> This is going to be a beautiful series and I'm, I'm I haven't forgotten my 80s and 90s action movies trailer reaction. I got some other trailers lined up for that one as well. Looking forward. Oh, this is. Yeah, I'm enjoying what I'm doing right now. I'm enjoying this process for sure. It's been a long time coming. It has been a long time coming. Long time coming, but I know a change gonna come. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, I have been your one. And only host, the Cosmic Jedi, reacting to these awesome 80s and 19 what 80s and 90s cartoon intro react. Mm. <laughs> awesome video. Thank you for watching, ladies and gentlemen. I'm trying not to do this whole like, share, and subscribe, but you know what to do. And if you're new to this channel, I'm surprised you haven't subscribed yet. And if you're not new to this channel, you're obviously liking the video, are you not? If you're not liking the video, then why are you here? <laughs> Don't waste your time. Mm.